joined, <laughs> we're joined by greatness today. So I'm not sure if you are aware, but um, Steve over here is doing a day in the life of Jack Scratch. Yeah. Spend a day with Jack Scrimshaw. Welcome. So this is Russ. Little Cavoodle. Um, he's five now. Got him up when I was in the Gold Coast, so um, he's had a haircut, so he's a bit he gets really fluffy. He gets matted, so that's to get a that's to get a bad haircut, but he's looking cute again. <laughs> Yeah, so I usually like to keep it pretty light in the morning, so I'll just have, have a smoothie, so I'll try to put a few ingredients in it, obviously fill me up and off, so I have enough energy for training and stuff, so, um, yeah, have some, have some strawberries, banana, oats, and some milk, and then I'll add some protein powder as well, which helps. I feel like it works for me. Might work different for others, but, but yeah, I've been enjoying this little little smoothie in the morning. So this is a day after our main training, so um, full day for us. We'll spend a little bit more time doing some cross training, uh, a little bit more cardio work with um, a bit more meetings and um, going through the game plan and stuff. So. Yeah, it is a long day, but um, yeah, our main training was obviously yesterday, so a little bit more recovery and um, trying to make sure that we're good for, for Thursday's session. <laughs> Need to get him in like a little elf suit for Santa, so he can fit in with the tree. Hey, He wants to get back to bed, he's telling me he wants to get back to bed, don't you? <laughs> Go on. Did you clean your house because you knew we were coming? Uh, yes, I did. Daisy and I just got new Apple Watches, and we've been we've been on the walkie-talkies. So I'll try and try and connect with him, see what his availability is like. He might be asleep. He never accepts me. He thinks he probably thinks that I'm overusing this. I've been been abusing it the last couple of days. Just trying to chat to him. You know, he's my friend and stuff. Unavailable. He's asleep. Not good enough. Let's go over to his house and wake him up. <laughs> this is my new favourite tea. Outdated sportswear. Get on him. Um, really loving this tea at the moment. <laughs> Let's go, mate. So Scrim, what's it feel like going into pre-season this year? Yeah, it's um, it's exciting. Obviously, we've got a got a much younger list now, so um, you know all the boys are full of full of energy and excitement, and um, yeah, it's a good place to be around at the at the minute. Um, so yeah, really excited. Um, had a good session yesterday. Um, yeah, it's tough. It's always tough work, but um, yeah, the, the vibes are high, and, and all the boys are. Are really um, yeah, embracing the challenge, so yeah, it's been good. And what's it like under Sam? Sam's been um, really good. Just you know, obviously we had a year under him last year with trying to um, you know figure out his philosophies and, and how he wants to wants us to play. So yeah, that's more about it's now. It's more about us just um, implementing a few more things and um, trying to work on the things that that we wanted to work on. Um, with his game plan and yeah, and continuing to evolve. So um, yeah, he's been really good, Sam. So you spoke about like the team goals. What are your personal aspirations for this season? Oh look, I just want to see us, you know, get back to where we belong as a footy club. Um, you know, I want to make sure that I'm putting in my best performance so we can get there as quick as possible. Um, we obviously know that we're we're younger and um, but 
look, that we're not going to use that as an excuse. We're going to obviously try and compete next year and um, you know continue to build and, and make progress. But yeah, personally, look, um, I just want to be the best player I can be. I feel like you know I'm 24 now, getting towards my sort of um, peak, sort of prime, sort of stage in, in my life and in my career. So. I think it's time for me to take another step and um, continue to improve. Yeah, pre-season seven, it's, uh, you know, they, they never get easier. Um, they're always, always very tough, but look, over the years I've, I've um, you know, sort of been injured through a few, so I hadn't really, really done too much throughout the pre-season. So over the last sort of two, three years, I've had an uninterrupted run, which is, which has been nice. So um, yeah, continuing to sort of, um, build more strength and, and um, improve improve my running. It's it's always a good time of the year to do that. Um, so yeah, quite optimistic with with this and going into my seventh preseason. Time does fly, um, but been enjoying it. Where do you usually park? Um, yeah, just in the sort of public car park. It'd be nice if I can get a pass to, to the basement, but got to be a big dog around here to get one of those. Sweet as. Let's get in there. Happening. Don't show my locker, it's bloody dirty. It's very messy. I need to sort some things out here. It's uh, a bit untidy for my liking. Let's go see if we can see any boys. Hey boys. It's happening. It's happening. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Loving it, yeah, loving the new tea. Hey, brother. Hey, mate. You Welcome good? to the day in the life. Yeah, 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 yeah thanks, yeah, mate. Sure. Thanks, brother. Thanks to the tea, mate. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so what's the story behind the tea, Shane? So this is Daisy's tea. Uh, he left it at mine a few weeks ago. I've been, I've been loving it, been wearing it, and he, he's hating it. So it's good luck like, pissing him off a bit. <laughs> hey, lads. What's happening? Bit of brekkie? What do you got here? Oh, you know. Just follow it in. It's a little TV show. That's starting. Yeah. It's off to you, mate. <laughs> yeah, obviously the physio room, so boys will come in here and get treatment and get looked after by these guys here. Um, and yeah, we're doing some testing at the moment, so. Um, testing our groins and our hammies and, and things like that, trying to. Get a bit of a baseline before the start of the season. Yeah, we test consistently throughout the season. You've done this one before, haven't you? Yeah, mate. So squeezing. Is that a warm up? Yep. 50 50%. 75%. 100%. Just for the camera, mate. You know you add 5% with the camera here. I'm just going to lower this down. Yeah. Yep. Between your knees. Between your knees. Oh! Yeah. It's on the money. There's some really good stretches you can do. Can you slide out? All done? Ankles? Yep. Just above the ankles. Just uh, come into the unit a little bit further, just above you. Is the machine bolted to the ground? <laughs> Breaking the foot up. This is huge. Come on, push, push, push. Oh, that's huge. You've done it. He's done it, mate. He's done it. All right, turn the camera off for the right. Thanks, mate. Hey. Oh, you know. Oh, 
What do I have? A smoothie this morning? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> smoothie, yogurt, you know. You've never had that in your life, have you? <laughs> we can check we can check my sleep last time actually if you want. Check check my last one. I only slept for six hours forty two last night, man. I had to get up at five thirty. Forty three minutes of deep sleep, that's not that great. Yeah, went to bed late. Come on. Let's go! Come on! Oh God. Is that the one? Is that the one? Oh wow. Done. Check what's going on out here. Good How'd you go? Good actually, yeah. Um, I actually test pretty well in those things compared to the actual gym stuff, but uh, yeah, my numbers are pretty good, so I'm happy with them. Who grew up wanting to be famous? Anyone? <laughs> we're joined. We're joined by greatness today. So I'm not sure if you are aware, but um, Steve over here is doing a day in the life of Jack Scripture. Yeah. yeah! But feel free to just get into the script as much as you want for the day, make his life um, enjoyable. Um, what do you reckon? How are you feeling? They came with you in the car and... Yeah, Steve was at my place at 10 to 6, so... 10 to 6? Yeah, it's good, mate. Went, yeah. for, a, went for a walk, you know. Get some yoga in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> if I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. Oh, we just come around and have a bit of a bit of a kick and do some skills. Um do some mobility work, what these guys are doing, you know. Loosen oh. up the body. Make sure we're feeling good for the sesh. Hey, this guy, this guy's following me around everywhere because he wants to be, he wants to be involved today. Mate, hey, we'll get you involved. Mate, hey, hey, we'll, we'll get you involved. I'll be out you. We'll get you involved today. What song do you want, Scrib? What song do you want to play? You get, you get the first choice. Makes you feel comfortable. I don't know what you want, actually. I don't know what you want. If I come up and I fall off, that's, that's on me. That's on me. If I fall and I sell out, that's we. I know that's we. That's why I take my time. That's why I take my time. Before I make my mind. Before I make my mind up. And I do this like seven, seven days, days out of the week. I do this daily. And I grind so hard, I don't get much sleep. I'm going crazy. I had to earn my stripes. So I don't have to work no nine. And I do this like seven, seven days out of the week. I do this and I grind so hard, I don't get much sleep. I had to earn my stripes, so I don't have to work no nine to five. Just a bit of a lighter session today, obviously had the main training yesterday, so um, yeah, a bit like key, which was which was nice, give the give the legs a bit of a spell, but um, yeah, training was good, standing was good, so happy. His impression so
Clip it on top of what I'm doing, you know me. And I know where to start. Forever is young. Simsy, Mo. So Mo was through my sort of high school because my older brother was Sim Mo, so I was the smaller one, so they shortened it to Mo. Sim <laughs> <laughs> <Same> City, <laughs> Sim <Same> Shady, Sim <laughs> Shady. And then this one, every now and then I get the haircut, so Faith Simpson. Good work. <laughs> It's good. Got a little insight to our uh, new coach in Kate Simpson, so it's good to hear a bit about his story and um, things like that. So yeah, it's good. Good insight. What are we doing now? So now we're uh, heading off to the gym. So gonna get some, gonna get big and put on some size. <laughs> I've got to focus at the moment, trying to build up some hammy strength. So. Um, yeah, been been having that as a focus for me in the gym, so we'll go go hit that pretty hard and um, yeah, get a good get a good workout out. Um, day after a main training, so feel fresh, feel feel pretty good, and uh, we'll see how we go. Been a productive morning and um, yeah got a bit to go we got another meeting after lunch and then um, and then what do we have <laughs> mate you're still going with this yes yes what was lunch was it good it's pretty good yeah pretty good go have fun thanks mate it's this place a bit of mexican place is it sorry mate what's the lunch you tacos <laughs> New fans that are tuning in and they see Sam Mitchell rolling around the club. What's he like as a as a coach? Yeah, look, he's like he's like one of the boys, really. Like he's, you know, obviously hasn't been out of the game for too long. Um, has a good connection with all the guys and um, likes to muck around a bit, which we all enjoy. But also has that hard edge to him, which which we need as a, as a young group. Um, so yeah, happy with how Sam's been going. All right, what about Hawthorne supporters? See on the Hawthorne supporter last year. Yep, Jazzy. What did you notice, Jazzy, last year? What did you notice about our forward line in particular? Yeah, I think it's a traditional one, but uh, Gunston and Bruce would always have that connection and um, hit each other up. Yep, why? Because they have that connection and that love, and I suppose always competing with one another and wanting to get better, um, so yeah. Yep, good. All right, so if you start at the top, you got brothers that have known each other since they're little kids. And then you've got, where is, where is Punk? Yeah. I've lost you now that I've swapped your seat, tell me where to look where. Um, how many games you played with Gunners? Probably 180. 180 games. So that's, you know, it's not brothers, you haven't lived together, but you're pretty close, you're here. Okay, now, um, Josh Weddle, if you came out of a, you, Break out of a stoppage, you're the winger, and you look up, who are you likely to kick it to? The open player. <laughs> <laughs> Good. 
<laughs> smart call. Smart call. You're going to kick it into our forward line. Who are you kicking it to? Um, well, I'll probably the, the key forward. Just tell me a player's name. It doesn't matter who. Uh, Mitch Lewis. Thank you. Well done. Mitch Lewis. Okay. So if we said that brothers is a 10, you've spent your whole life together, and these guys are it's probably still a maybe eight and a half. Where is Josh Weddle and Mitch Lewis? I don't know, but it's down here somewhere, isn't it? Okay. And do we acknowledge that the more brothers we have in a team, the better we'll play? We acknowledge that? That's, that's, you have to be good enough at footy and all that. <coughs> if the more relationships and the tighter you can be, the better we will play. I know I've spoken to some of you about this now. Goal setting, we've been talking a lot about, and pre-season is inherently, how can you as an individual get better? But part of you as an individual getting better, going by that evidence, is what? Investing time in others. Investing time in others, building in relationships, getting to know other people. Which Lewis, if he's smart, who's he spending a heap of time with to make his footy better? It sounds like a terrible thing to say. But if he wants to be the very best player he can be, who does he need strong relationships with? That's a key forward. Good kick. Anyone who's kicking in the ball. What about inside midfielders? Who are pretty important for them? Rucks. Rucks should never ever buy coffee in a football club, just so you know. You have so much power over all these little blokes. Is that right, Harry? Yeah. <laughs> oh, here he is. What are you doing, mate? <laughs> Stretching, you know, helping out my man. Bint. Stop. It's a new specialty. I might have to, might have to look after all the boys. Yeah. Takes very good care of these deep stretches. Hey, Chad. What are your thoughts on Johnny? Big fella. Making me work right here. Where are your friends at? No friends here. <laughs> Not today. On my own program. <laughs> the mini footies that are here, the club is running uh, a program where if you sign up to be a member on Saturday at Aquiston Training, you receive a free signed footy. So not everyone needs to sign every football, but if you could get three, four, five signatures on every single football, so make sure all footies have the signature, but you don't have to sign all of them, that would be great before you leave today. Right, right, right. Right, up to go. Harvey Stroop down to the pool. Everyone else, organise. Where are Yeah, we're just going to be signing some footies now for some um, people who, who sign up as members on Sunday. So on Saturday rather, um, so they'll receive a foot, free footy signed by us. These uh, Sharpies are a little bit too fresh for my life, so it's hard to nail it. What do you think? Hope you guys like it. Not much to it. It's a photo? Yeah, it's a photo. Sorry. Oh, sorry. So now I've got an um, individual catch up with Sam, so we just go through some of my goals for the, the pre-season, um, just bit talk about how I've been going, uh, things like that. So I'll spend about 10, 15 minutes with him and yeah, have a little catch up, we're good. I don't think he can come in, mate. Oh, Sam doesn't want him. I got some criticism about the state of the office. CJ reckons I need to clean up. I know. Oh, I've got stuff. I've got stuff. It's alright. Can we help, mate? Yeah, mate. Yeah. 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 See you, mate. <laughs> What's this face? Good day, yeah, all done. Um, nearly four o'clock, so yeah, it's been a long one, but yeah, it's been been enjoyable. You off, mate? You off? Off. Just a half day. Yeah. <laughs> half day, yeah. Just a half day, guys. Good one, buds. <laughs> <laughs> go home and walk Russ. You, bro. Give Russ a walk when you go. If he's lucky. 
day in the life. See you guys. See you, mate. What do you usually do when you get home? Um, well, I'll get the day off tomorrow, so yeah, I'll just keep back when I get home, just relax. I won't do too much. Yeah, looking forward to it actually. Car's too loud, mate. We're trying to fiddle. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you uh, enjoyed um, my day today. I hope you got something out of it, and uh, yeah. Thanks, thanks for watching.